Why, hello there, everybody! Welcome back to Lemmy's World Tour. Praise God on this glorious day today. And today, we're continuing with the professional rank. So, I'll be honest, the professional rank thus far has been... Well, surprisingly easy. For the most part, I've been finding it easier than the amateur rank. But maybe that's all about to change. I don't know. Let's find out. We're on level 16, Pompeii. Oh my gosh, this level looks amazing. And also, it fills me with a little bit of fear because I know what happened at Pompeii. And it was pretty destructive. This is by Bastille. We've got 40 lemmings. We can kill three of them. Holy cow, this level looks amazing. Are you going to be an optimist about this? No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Alright, well, we've got basically an unlimited amount of builders and platformers, which is nice. Five of the destructive skills. Five swimmers, which actually can be used to cross the lava, which is... It's a little weird, but, you know, whatever. And free stoners. Okay, so I'm actually going to try carving a path out ahead of time on this one. That looks freaking awesome. I think that comes from a Sonic tile set of some kind. That looks pretty boss as well. Oh my gosh, this level looks so good! Alright, well, we got platform. Oh my gosh, really? There's a crack there. It's a crack in the terrain there. So we can't go under and around. Okay, so maybe we need to go on the top. I don't know. Well, at the very least, we're going to need a stoner for this part. All right, well, let's just try messing around then, shall we? First things first. Alright, we're gonna do that. He's gonna be a swimmer. I just like going out and trying stuff, you know? Not sure whether bashers or fencers are gonna be more useful on this level. For example, I think bashing through all of this is going to be the further best. Boom, yeah, perfect. Now we need to gain some height, which means we're going to fence through this. Yeah, I still think it's weird that swimmers can swim through the lava. I feel like that should act like fire and not water. But th th maybe that's just me. Okay, so we actually cannot fence through up all of this. Not even close. Now, here's the next question. How far down can we mine in order to fence out of this? I like that. Yes, please. And we've got so many builders left. We're going to need to build up a bit higher than that, though. So 
So the lemmings are not going to be able to walk up that. The terrain is too weird. So we can do this. Use our last... Well, not our last basher. Okay, how far can they fall? Oh, sweet, they can fall all the way down if they want. That's great. End part is where this is where things are going to get tricky. Is at the end. Oh my gosh, wait. I know. <laughs> okay, this is going to be really, really tricky to perfectly precise uh, time. Alright. We need the left side of this digger tunnel to be right above the trigger area for the exit. This is going to be really, really, really tough. Because I'm almost thinking we might have to dig through part of the stoner. Which, holy cow, that would be really tricky. Hmm. Because <sighs> the trigger area on the exit is so low down. Stunners are just so high up. Hmm. See, now this is actually a tricky level. I can't figure out how to get into the exit. Why would you put steel there? Alright, now, tricky... No, for the tricky part, can we let just one lemming out and hold the rest back somehow? Yes, I think we can. So they're just gonna all walk towards the exit. But the nice thing is we still have a lot of destructive skills left, so what's gonna happen is they're gonna start making their way up here. Oh, what? You know what? That's great. We have one lemming that's going ahead. I did not think they were going to walk up that. So what I want to do is I want to separate just one lemming out from the crowd. Perfect! Just like that. So 
so he's gonna walk over here, fall down, hit the steel, fall down over here. And he's gonna dig. I'll make it a little above the lava. There we go. Wow. That was tricky figuring it out at the end, even though it was kind of simple in the wall in the run. Wow. And I would guess that is intended, because, I mean, even though there's a ton of skills left over, I, I knew we were going to have skills left over on that level. And holy cow, that took 11 minutes to do one level. Hopefully the rest won't be as time-consuming. We're on level 17, Surfing Bird. <laughs> Okay, so we've got that nice looking, like, oh, bird in the tree. And then we've got, oh, one of Nintendo Addict's cat traps in there. This is by the Trash Men. And there's going to be cloners involved. Nice. Everyone's heard about the bird. Oh, that's the exit, I believe. Yep. And the exit's actually up in the air. So we can't afford to let anybody die. We have one swimmer. we got to avoid that cat trap. Oh, and there are lemmings out of two hatches. Luckily, they are safe. We got 12, 12 builders. Holy cow. Oh my gosh, not quite. <laughs> oh, are you serious? I'm doing it that way, we'll let them out. Alright. <laughs> now we just build, build, build to the exit, I guess. This might be trickier than I was expecting it to be. Or maybe not, maybe not. Because we can fence up through here. stack. That'll turn everybody around, and then we can build up into the exit. Now we can bash these guys out, and then dig these guys out, and also clone one of them. And now everybody should get to go to the exit. Not sure if that was intended or not, but I don't care. The owl's just like, whoa! I can't believe you backrooted that! Ho-ho! <laughs> Link, your quest has only just begun. Actually, that might not have been a backward at all, but hey, I beat the level, and in less time than I beat Pompey, so I'm cool with that. Let's see what the next level has in store. We're on level 18, 
sur le pont d'Aveyron. It's traditional. This is definitely a, a French level. I love the crystal water. Holy cow, that's really pretty. Got to save everybody on this one. So, yeah, oh, yeah, you get the nice looking garden there. Got the beautiful crystal water, the beautiful bridge. Oh, this looks so nice. Well, we got gliders. No, oh, I was about to say, no swimmers. No, no, we got swimmers. Well, let's see. Oh, uh, what? Hang on. Okay. No, don't climb. Uh uh, man, you, you dingus, don't do that. I think I already see where this is gonna go. Oh, please, glider, please go far enough. Beautiful. And the best part is they can even climb up. And I mean, yeah, we might as well close out the gap. So now all that's left to do is save these guys, and we can use that save them with a miner. Um, somehow we can do that. We'll have to turn them around. Which actually might be really, really tough. Hmm. Okay, this might actually be a bit tricky. Because I actually think I have to mine this way. That's going to be taking too much time, I think. You know what? A lot of these guys can drown. That's fine. Yeah, I don't think... I think that's going to take too much time. I don't think the gliders are going to make it across the bridge now. Eh. Oh, wait a second. Better idea. Better idea. I can literally turn them around right here. Now that'll save me the digger, and I should still have one builder left at the end. Oh, yeah. Oh, everything's just nicely falling into place, isn't it? We even use less gliders this way. Now what we can do... Oh, hang on a second. Mr. Athlete, could you please dig down there? They'll all be able to get out, no problem. 
Beautiful. Oh, that was a really fun level. It seems so simple, but there's some ins and outs, and you really have to use the terrain to your advantage. But that was a really fun one. Beautiful architecture, beautiful solution, and just a little bit tricky. I, I really like that one. Well done, Strato. We are on level 19 today. Atakata Nuva, traditional. I, hmm... I've definitely seen that flag before, but I can't put my finger on where it is. But this is a beautiful looking snow level. Holy cow. We've got some of the snow tile set. We've got some of Ray Manny's snow tile set as well. Wow, this is going to be nice. Got to save all 20 lemmings today. Danger Fin Ice. Oh, and it's got the perfect music for it, too. Alright, so it goes over there. That's water, so we're going to need a swimmer and probably platform across there. Or alternatively, platform across the top and mine our way down. That could also work. Oh wait, though, that's steel. Those look like uh, igloo blocks, but no, that's steel, so we're going. We can't actually do that. So, question, if they fall, can they survive? No, they can't. How far can they survive? Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho! Clever, clever. Now, if that's gonna be enough... I'm going to make that slightly different. I'm going to ricochet off the wall. Just like that. Oh, beautiful. I like that. Let's make him climb up. Oh, icicle traps. I, or icicle trap. <laughs> but you know what? That's fine. He's a glider. How to turn him around? I see the problem. Then you know what? An even better idea? Well, hang on. We might need the miner to get them out because I don't think a fencer is gonna do the trick. Yeah, I'm gonna need the miner to get them out. Which means. I need the miner to get these lemmings out at this point. And I'm pretty sure you're gonna need the blocker for here. And we do need to save the blocker as well. So I'm missing something here. I could build from such a... Well, hang on. No, those are at the same part. Uh -huh. I could potentially build from such a way that this stops them from splitting, then we can, like, fence up from here. But I'm not sure what good that would ultimately do. Maybe we don't need... If we were to 
platform like this and make this guy a glider. Ah, no, he still dies. That's a shame. Oh, bother. Oh, wait a second, hang on. I have an idea. <laughs> so I think we actually can use the miner here at the end. We're gonna do is we're gonna mine just like this. Mine all the way through, but to said to turn around. Now we're going to platform in such a way that we just get across. Like that. But instead of climbing up, we're gonna fence up. And now we should be able to build up here, fence out the uh, blocker. And let them all go free. Oh wow, that was such a good level. Also, didn't mention it before, but I love the snow. I mean, I made the snow, but... Oh, that was such a good level. Simple, but also really tricky trying to suss out the solution with all the terrain. Really nice level, holy cow. Also, Raymani's snow tile set is just a great tile set. Alright, so we got one level left. Maybe we can beat it in three minutes. That would be great. I don't know. Level 20, Rome. Oh, look at that Colosseum. Oh man, that looks better than the Colosseum I made for my Art Lems level. Knock on it. This is by 10, and we can kill 5 Lemmings. Alright. A song by a comparatively unknown rock group from Manchester. But it's named after a city, so it's in here. Okay, what? So we got Teleporter and then Receiver. Well, looks like we're going to have to use it. As much as I just like that. Also, needles in the wall. Beautiful. Now here's the question. Okay, we absolutely want just one money to go through there. Oh, great. And it's going to be another case of the dumb teleporter. Because they could go in either direction. Okay, so actually what we're going to do... bring out three lemmings to begin with. So you can go stack away. Actually, that might be not a good idea. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because now they're going to splat more likely than not. Oh yeah, they're definitely going to splat if I do that. Well, bother. Oh, 
What if we did something really, really bizarre? I mean, you know? Oh, doggone you, why can't you go lower than that? Well, can we actually go lower with the stoner? Me? That would be great if we could. Beautiful. Is that? Not very. Okay. So maybe we can get this to work. Oh, boo. Thank goodness for stackers. Never thought I'd say that. Oh, what? That's stupid. Actually, no. Wait. It might not be. Things aren't going my way, that's stupid. <laughs> Come on, yeah! Well, um, maybe that's a backward, I don't know. But now, here's the thing the annoying part is you have to just wait for them all to teleport in. But I had quite a few skills left over, so I call that a success. Woo! So that wasn't my favorite level, mainly because again, teleporter levels. I've yet, I've really yet to encounter a teleporter level that was like amazing. And I mean, that one wasn't terrible, but I have a feeling that that was a because that was such a hacky solution. I don't think that was the intended. But who knows? Anyhow, that's all the time we have for today. Thanks for watching, everybody. Tune in next time for five more professional levels, unless something goes dreadfully horribly wrong. Well, we'll have to wait and see. Until we meet again, my friends, have a great day, and God bless.